you guys know that the arms and the stick of a hockey player actually make a lever? And levers are simple machines, and simple machines help us do work. Oh, you mean like my homework? Not exactly that kind of work, unfortunately. It's a different kind of work that we do in science. Oh, I know which work you're talking about. It's the force times the distance. Exactly. Okay, so like if I move an object, if I use a force to move this object, and I move at a distance, then I've done some work. Exactly. That's awesome. So why don't we try an experiment then? Sparty, would you like to help us out? Awesome. Okay. We're gonna use this hockey stick. This is for you. And we're gonna use this bucket full of pucks. So, Sparty, what I'm gonna get you to do is hold that hockey stick at the very end with your hands and try to lift this bucket using only the hockey stick. Do you guys think that Sparty's gonna be able to do it? I don't know, we'll see. Okay, ready, Sparty? Go. Oh, oh. Come on, a little. I think I saw a little. Yeah, maybe oh. just a little, but that That's seemed close. really hard. So I think I know what the problem is. Sparty, if I didn't give you any instructions, how would you lift this bucket with the stick? How would you usually oh, do it? Oh, I think you'd be next. Uh, oh, oh, yay! Great. Perfect. So he actually made a fall from with his hand. So now you have a pivot point in the middle that you use to help you lift the bucket. And that's what hockey players do with their sticks too. So to help us to show how levers are used in hockey sticks, we have Senator's forward Kyle Turris here. He's first going to take a shot on net, putting both of his hands at the very end of the stick. And then we'll see how he does it properly. So go ahead, Kyle. Not a lot of power in that one. Let's try again with the lever. So here I have a giant lever and with it I would be able to do work and so lift things I would be normally not be able to lift. So who should I lift? Hmm, I think I should lift you Sparty. Yeah, you. Okay, so we're going to have to get on one end of the lever, like this. Okay, so who thinks I'd be able to lift him with this giant lever? Let's find out. Three, two, one. Oh, that's not working. Oh, Sparty, you're too heavy. What did you eat for breakfast this morning? Hmm, a lot, apparently. <laughs> All right, but I know how to fix this. I'm going to move the fulcrum of the lever towards Sparty, so my end of the lever will be longer. Okay. All right, who thinks I'd be able to lift Sparty now? Three, two, one. So by using a simple machine, I'm able to do a lot more work than I would normally be able to do. Thanks, Barty. Are you afraid of heights? I hope not. <laughs>